So today we'll be looking over the Hunter's HD Gold Active Blue. Uh, I got these glasses from Brian at Nationals in October and uh, mostly to replace my regular native sunglasses just because, you know, the HD Golds have always been a lot brighter and and clearer and, and the really nice glasses and the transitioning, you know, when it's brighter and, or dim outside or whatnot. It's, it's always been a plus. Um, I've tried, you know, wearing the golds themselves, uh, you know, driving or whatnot, and and it was fine. It was bright. It was clear. It was nice. But you know, the lights, the green lights, were kind of blue. So um, I, you know, after a while, I kind of got a little bit on my nerves. It was kind of cool at first, and it's like ah, I don't like that. So when I was able to get the act of blue in October, I've been pretty much wearing all these every time when I go out and uh, instead of my regular sunglasses, which I've been heavily enjoying these because where I live at and when I have to drive somewhere, it could be cloudy where I live at, but and it could just end up clearing up in 30 minutes. And then so I don't have to transition from cloudy days like I do with the regular sunglasses. On this, it's like, yeah, I could just wear these and it's fine during cloudy days. And then as soon as it brightens up, it's still fine. It's perfect pair of sunglasses, just just as he advertises, it changes so you don't have to. And that holds true. These active blues, you know, are, um, they, they brighten up the day in a way. So I can see why Brian's always smiling and always wearing them because it's always a bright day for him. So let's take these glasses out and uh, he's trying to do a comparison in uh, cloudy weather to see what they look like on camera. Another nice, cloudy, slightly rainy day in Kentucky. So, uh, if you're wearing regular sunglasses, like these natives that I have here, it makes it a little dark. Not so bad. These are polarized. And with the Hunter's HD Gold Active Blue, It's a little bit brighter. Now with the golds, definitely a lot brighter. Gold. Blues. Blues look more, are definitely great for Every day, kind of driving about, doing your thing, whatnot. It doesn't change the uh, stop the traffic lights. It doesn't make the green look blue like the yellows. And uh, there's still nice clarity, and of course they're polarized, and they darken up as the light gets more and lines up as it needs to. I can see why Brian Conley is always smiling because it's just a bright, bright day for him because he's always wearing these kind of glasses. It just brightens up the day. So if you're playing with the red dot, this is how it will look with regular sunglasses. A little dark. And this is how it will look with HD Gold. They both still pop out. Most of the time, it's not really seeing the dots, rather more seeing the target that you hit and if you have to make up, do makeup shots. But, it looks almost dark, active blue. Yeah, blue. Regular sunglasses. I mean, it just all pops out the same, but it's a matter of seeing that target hole. But you can use these for uh, for shooting competitions. I mean, they're they're you know almost they're pretty much rated as safety glasses, so they they'd be a lot better to use than regular sunglasses that you pick up off the shelves or expensive Oakleys. I had Oakleys before, and they were nice, but 
the natives were just as good and cheaper, but then came across, across uh, Hunter's HD Gold Active Blue, and it's I think it's just a lot better. How the Active Blue looks, at least through an iPhone camera and through a red dot, it, they are very good glasses. I mean, I've had Oakley's before, and like I said, and, and then the natives and. And these are just a lot brighter, a lot clearer. I'm able to wear them inside and outside. And cloudy days, I could just start it with the cloudy days. And if it clears up, then I could just leave them on. They're just, they're really good glasses. Um, they've been very handy the last six months and or six plus months. And someday I'll probably, and hope, probably next time I run into Brian, I'll probably buy a pair of the, the rubies and see how those look too. But mostly I'll probably, the rubies will be mostly for review and playing around, but I could see the active blue is something I'd be wearing more every day. And of course the HD golds I'll be, I wear during shooting matches. But overall, I mean, it's, if you're looking to replace your regular glasses with something a little clearer, a little brighter, something that transitions and and just really good quality product made in the USA. The Hunter's HD Gold Active Blue is is a great product if you just want some regular quality, high quality regular sunglasses. And if you're looking for some high quality I mean and they'll also work for the range, but if you're also looking for some high quality range glasses so you can see the target better then you'll get the gold and with all these if you need a prescription you can work with brian and he'll will make the lenses to your prescription so you don't have to wear glasses underneath or whatnot you could just wear these all or all the time or whenever you need them so check them out at huntershdgold.com